I'm Jay Wilcox. It's a busy week in high school sports with section playoffs going on in several sports, including baseball. Maple Grove won Section 8 4A last spring in the Crimson of the second seed behind St. Michael Albertville this year. Hardly a cloud in the sky as the Crimson host Elk River. The Elk strike first in this one. Wyatt Morrell rips the ball deep to center field. And this one will roll all the way to the fence. Cole DeLyden scores from first base on the play. The Elks add another run to lead two to nothing after half an inning. The Crimson get one back in the bottom of the first. The Elks turn a nice 4-6-3 double play in the field, but Josh Tyler scores from third on the play to make it a two to one game after an inning. Same score in the third when the Crimson take the lead. Luke Hansen delivers a single to right center field. Tyler and Jensen Erickson score on the hit. Maple Grove goes ahead three to two. But in the fourth, the Elks come right back. Delighton bloops a single to short center field here. Brad Geis scores to tie the game. Elk River adds another run in the inning to take the lead four to three. The Crimson tied up in the fifth with Jerome Gouley at the plate. A wild pitch allows Erickson to slide home in a cloud of dust. It's four to four through five innings. It stays that way until the bottom of the eighth. Maple Grove loads the bases and Delighton will pitch to Hayden Thompson. He lifts a fly ball to left field. The catch is made here, but it's easily deep enough to allow Bubba Horton to tag up and score the game winning run as Maple Grove scratches out a five to four win over Elk River. Maple Grove is home again today, Thursday.